Hola amigos, this is your Spanish maestro with a new lesson for you today. Today we are going to learn the months of the year in Spanish. So my friends, let's begin our class. Before we start, I request you once again, please subscribe to my channel and keep learning Spanish with me, Sir Ahmed. So let's begin the class, my friends. The months of the year in Spanish. Uh, most, of, most of the months in Spanish are very similar to our English equivalent. Pay attention and please learn how to pronounce these months. So, repeat with me. Enero. Enero. January. Febrero. Febrero. February. Marzo. Marzo. March. Abril. Abril. April. Mayo. Mayo. May. Junio, Junio, June. Julio, Julio, July. Agosto, Agosto, August. Septiembre, 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 September. Octubre, Octubre, October. Noviembre, Noviembre. November, Noviembre, Diciembre, Diciembre, December, Diciembre. Uh, remember, in one of our first lessons, I told you in the Spanish language, we must pronounce each alphabet in the word. Each alphabet has a particular sound which never changes in any word. Please learn the sounds of the alphabets uh, so you will be able to master pronouncing Spanish words. A quick recap of the must of the months: Enero, Febrero. Marzo, Abril, Mayo, Junio, Julio, Agosto, Septiembre, Octubre, Noviembre, and Diciembre. Okay, a simple sentence uh, with each month of the year saying January is the first month, etc. Okay, so we'll do first, second, third. Now learn these. Enero es el primer mes del año. January is the first month of the year. Febrero es el segundo mes del año. February is the second month of the year. Marzo es el tercer mes del año. March is the third month of the year. Abril es el cuarto mes del año, the fourth month. Mayo es el quinto mes del año, fifth month. Quinto es fifth. Junio es el sexto mes del año, sexto es sixth. Julio es el séptimo mes del año. Septimo, septimo, seventh. Agosto es el octavo mes del año, octavo, eighth. Septiembre es el noveno mes del año, noveno, ninth. Octubre es el décimo mes del año, décimo, tenth. Okay, uh, from uh, the first to the tenth, if you learn it's enough. Uh, you don't have to go to eleventh and twelfth. These are enough for basic conversation, okay? So, Primer or primero, okay, primer mes, we don't say primero mes, okay, we say primer mes. So, these are simple sentences of the first and the second month, etc. Now, how do we say first, second, third, fourth, etc. in Spanish? First is primero, if you're talking about something masculine, okay. For example, uh, el primer o coche o el primero. Uh, mi coche es el primero en la fila. My car is the first in line. Okay. Primero en la, fi en la fila. Primera. We use for feminine. Okay. Uh, la primera casa en esta calle es mía. La primera casa en esta calle es mía. The first house on the street is mine. Segundo, segunda. Masculine, feminine. Tercero, tercera, and so on. Cuarto, cuarta, quinto, quinta, sexto, sexta, séptimo, séptima, octavo, octava, noveno, novena, décimo en décima. So, another set of vocabulary for you to learn. Now, time periods, okay? Uh, day, week, etc. How do we say that in Spanish? Okay, so, el día, the day. La semana, the week. La quincena. Okay, fortnight or 15 days. La quincena. El mes, the month. El semestre. Uh, 
six months or half a year, el semestre, el año, the year, or un año, a year, la década, okay, uh, a decade, or una década, ten years, el siglo, or un siglo, hundred years, un siglo, a hundred years. Okay, we also have trimestre, el trimestre, a uh, quarter of a year or three months is called el trimestre. So this was our short class of today, uh, learning the months of the year and how we say first, second, third, fourth, etc. plus time periods. So I hope you enjoyed today's class, my friend. Keep watching, keep looking out for my new classes. I upload at least one or two classes every day. Very soon, uh, we have completed level one of Spanish uh, and I have begun level two classes. Uh, keep watching. Very soon, we will complete level two as well and you will be very, very proficient in Spanish very soon. Any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section. I will answer your questions and clarify your doubts. Thank you very much, friends. Hasta luego, amigos.